Welcome back guys for another video. In today's video, we are back at it yet again. And in today's video, I have some amazing news to give just for you guys because the biggest reveal for the next Valentine's Day event. And yes, it's not an update. It's an event which means that the big update will not be releasing yet and only an up event will be releasing now. And it's actually a pretty amazing event but it's also uh, it's also a pretty l it's a pretty l uh event in my opinion and i'll be explaining today why um let's go dive into the video uh that zeol is released so quick if you want to get yourself some free robux check out robuxworker.com robuxworker.com you can get yourself some free robux it's limited time only so hurry as you can see i typed up robuxworker.com claim reward choose the gift card i want for completely free i go do two surveys and boom i get the code as you guys can see right here we are gonna dive in in the video that he released um called the new valentine's day event where he showed the love fruit rework and apart from the love fruit rework there's also one other fruit that's going to get a rework which is awesome there's gonna be two fruits that's gonna get a rework in this update which is cool i'm very excited for that as well as you guys can see the uh, flamingo ride is there and um, as you guys can see, Zeolus is over there, and he's gonna be showing us the, the booths for Heart. Now I'm going to make a different video about Heart food since I can't fit all these, uh, all these, um, all these, uh, vid all these, uh, everything that was made in his video in just one video. I'm gonna talk about that in a different video. But when I, what I want to talk about right now is the fact that this update might be an L update because um. They, they from the looks of it would not be adding that many they from the looks of it would not be adding that many sword reworks i don't know if it's true but from the looks of it they would be adding only a couple sword reworks in this update maybe just adding something like um uh love fruit reworks uh the spider rework and also like um one sword rework which is the katana there is proof that the dual katana is going to get reworked already um he did show something with the dual katana in this video it's very interesting to see how they'll rework it but apart from these two apart from the dual katana apart from the dual katana and the love fruit rework and the string rework there's really nothing in this uh there's really nothing in this um update that makes me think it's a good update or i would say that um it's a pretty good update because we're gonna get a love fruit rework and we're also gonna get a um we're also gonna get a what they call this a string rework which is gonna be called spider and apart from that we're also gonna be getting accessories um with this update as you guys can see however this is where i think they're starting to get lazy though because in the last 10 billion event updates in the last 10 billion update the uh, 10 billion visit updates this is the exact same thing they did in the 10 billion visit update they didn't change anything it kind of makes me think that they're starting to get lazy guys um it's th it's still gonna be a good update it's still gonna be a decent update. However, it makes me think that they're starting to get lazy. Because if you could check over here, um, if you could see this, this is like the exact same thing. Like just copy pasted into um a different event, you know. But they the way you get hearts though, it's pretty different. Um, apparently, if you wanna get hearts, you're gonna fight NPCs your level, and the more players in the private server, the more hearts you're gonna get. Which is definitely a pretty W. Um, it's definitely pretty W the way they did that. It's cool. However, the fact that they're recopying th these events, like this is legit just the same event as the 10 billion visit update, except with the reworks, which is gonna be nice because they're gonna rework um two fruits uh, alongside one other sword. And if you can see right here in the uh in, in the display capture, you can see right here that Zeolus is actually gonna be using dual katana, as you guys can see right here. He's using dual katana and he has a move called dual katana 2, which I'm gonna uh, present a screenshot right now. He has a sword called Dual Katana 2, which maybe hints at a sword rework. However, it makes me think that only Dual Katana is going to get a rework for this update, which is uh, pretty interesting. The last big update for Block Suits was around six months ago, so um, if they don't if they don't add like the big update soon, it would be very it would be like six seven months um, since the last big update. Which is pretty disappointing, but I guess they are taking their time. I'm not saying it, they're, it's bad. I'm just saying that um, it's taking really long for them to release these updates, which is not bad because I mean the update might be big, but this event might be another one of those small updates. And the worst part is, uh, in my opinion, it's copy pasted uh, from the last about uh, 10 billion visit update. 
As you guys can see, it's the exact same format. The exact same format to the 10 billion visit updates, which is kind of an L, if you ask me. However, um, to be honest, I think it's fine um, since we're gonna get a Love Fruit rework and a Spider rework and maybe a few Sword reworks as well. They, they didn't show the Sword reworks here, but maybe we're gonna get that in a different vid uh, when, the game when the update releases. I'm not too sure. But yeah, this update, uh, this event is going to be pretty small and it's also just like a copy paste of the 10 billion visit up event. But that's gonna be guys for today's video. I'm gonna talk about the love fruit rework and the spider fruit rework, uh, the string fruit rework in different videos. Thanks for watching and peace out everybody.